I was sitting in the bed, sitting up, watching television, and all of a sudden I kind of heard um, some bullet shots. She says shootings are all too common in her neighborhood, but last night one came too close for comfort. Felicia Gilbert's home sits near Lillian Avenue and I-70. That is in the Walnut Park East area of St. Louis. She tells us after being rocked out of bed by bullets, she's now faced with a very tough decision, livelihood and life. It's just like we're in the middle of a war. Felicia Gilbert and her husband have lived in this North City home for 20 years. Gunfire, sadly, is something they're now used to. But this time, it just sounds like it was coming in the room with me. And it was. About 11 Monday night, police say bullets were fired into the Gilbert's home. I jumped on the floor and I started crawling because my daughter. The bullets went through the front of the house, into the master bedroom, through the closet, all right next to where her daughter was sleeping. I get up and we see all of this fragments. You see the bullet that went through and pierced through at least four of his jackets. Gilbert says there is constant gunfire and crime in their area and they want to move. I can't do this anymore. I can't. And police can only do so much. They came today because it's not an emergency and they took a report and, and pretty much just said that if we find, find the bullet, to give them a call. The problem with leaving, Gilbert says, is the property value of their home is diminished because of all of the deterioration and crime around them. You've situated a group of people, families that don't have any hope. And Gilbert says her hope for a safe community is lost. I just feel like I'm in the middle of Iraq with my house trying to be pleasant. Our newsroom did reach out to city police. They do tell us they are investigating. Also, the city's crime prevention program, Cure Violence, is working in the Walnut Park area in North City.